Welcome to Matchbox. Welcome to the team. Culture of Matchbox. Well, it's a little quirky, fun, innovative, energetic. The food is really, really good. You know, you get your neighborhood vibe, which we crush. For me, it's my second home. <laughs> We're like a family at Matchbox. It's very laid back, very rustic chic. We really embrace passion, we really embrace positivity. Matchbox is fun. Exciting! Yeah. Welcome to the team. What makes for a good Matchbox employee is Someone who cares about others. Someone who is attentive, creative, they know the menu, so knowledgeable personality is key. I think the culture is to be who you are and to be part of a team and to contribute to the overall success of everybody. And it's a place where you can really be who you are and grow to be the person that you want to be. Matchbox is a great place to build a career. It's allowing you to uh, get the support, uh, the tools you need to do your job very well. And when you do it very well, you get rewarded for it and you get to move on. We definitely feed off the energy of the three founders um, who are her kind of do it yourself, pick yourself up by the bootstraps and get it done kind of guys who you know they have a high standard. They want to do it right. You know, it's genuine, it's passionate, it's soulful. Those values haven't changed. They remain to be strong in the core values and, and icons that we have. The icons, they always give me a refreshing focus on something to, to open up my eyes to uh, and something to help differentiate us from our competitors. So even if we have 12 restaurants or 50 restaurants, you still feel like you're part of something that has grassroots. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Congratulations to everybody. All right, you guys. Out here. I think the icons at Matchbox guide me in my job every day because they all play a role in our lives every day at the restaurant. Yeah, the, the idea with these icons is that you, you have to live them. We've got to exemplify what these icons stand for. The first one is called the sweet spot. That we think that, that all three concepts really, Matchbox, Ted's Bulletin, and DC3, are in the sweet spot for what people want today. Casual, great value, not fine dining, but, but right in the middle. And this is really our value proposition. The next one is called the number one thing. Uh, the number one thing better be important because it's the number one thing. It is our job to cause the guests to return, to provide hospitality, good food, and a warm and inviting atmosphere so that that guest will return. So everybody on the floor from busser, server, bartender, chef, manager, they know that their job, the number one thing, is to cause that guest to return. PMA was positive mental attitude, and that attitude is everything in life. It's our hiring philosophy. You'll notice the glass is not half empty, that glass is half full. And that's the type of people that we're looking for. How's your PMA? Terrific. Giving the pickle is our service philosophy, and everybody knows that their job in giving them the pickle is to give that guest a warm and inviting and wonderful hospitality experience. If it's going to enhance their experience, if it's going to cause them to return, then you give them the pickle. Uh, is it pro? Is a, is a performance standard around everything. Is it professional? We're trying to stay away from this idea of corporate. Ah, they become corporate. And we're looking for professional. We want you to be professional. So pro is a performance standard that we talk about in everything we do. The food is only as good as the hand that prepares it. Talks about the skill level of our chefs, the skill level of our kitchen people. So slow down, present your food with love, and do things right. It carries right all the way to the guests from the front of the house as well. You want to handle this food with care and place it properly on the table. So this goes all the way to the guest. Three steps in refers to the senses being engaged when you hit our front door. All five senses are gonna be alive. You're gonna have a first impression from the host stand of the ambiance to smell. Here, you're gonna see and feel if the restaurant is alive. We're looking for Matchbox and Ted's Bulletin and DC3 to feel right. Three steps in, this is the place to be, and it's up to us to cultivate that environment. 
And the last one here, but not least of the eight, is performance family. So this is a little bit of the, the accountability piece. This is about teamwork. We are a family, but we're a performance family. If you go in and you don't perform, I'm gonna have to play someone else. I love you. You're still part of our performance family. I'm gonna coach you to be better. And everybody knows that they have to perform. All of our employees know that these are the standards. These are the themes, these are the ideas. The icons are our, are our values. They're our performance values. And so our, our employees know that their performance is measured against these hospitality themes that they themselves have come up with. Uh, so it's exciting to use this vocabulary. It's exciting to use these themes. Welcome to the team. Matchbox Food Group, light up your career. Light it up. Yeah. Hi, good evening. Welcome to Matchbox. How can I help Welcome you? Welcome to Matchbox Food Group. Together, we can light it up. Let's light it up. Welcome to Matchbox Food Group. We are Matchbox. I'm fired up. <laughs>